Of course. <clears throat> I'm African. Yes, I'm African. And it's the reason why most of the time I like to come online to tell you the truth about we Africans. Yeah. I wouldn't have gotten this privilege if it were to be in Ghana, where I come from originally. Yes, in Ghana we use bucket to fetch water and then go to the bathhouse to bath. But here I'm using the shower. Yes, I'm running clean water to bath. And from here I'm going to take you guys to the carnival. Yes, I went to the carnival here in Brasilia. So I want to explore with you guys how we celebrate it here. I love, I love living here in Brazil. I've been living here for the past uh, 14 years, okay? And uh, I've been able to naturalize for the past 10 years. So, um, and I, 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 I won't lie about it. Me as an African here, I love it so much because the people are very lovely. And, you know, one of the best things about here is even though there are there is corruption in Brazil, uh, life is very easy out here for you as a foreigner and to own a property here in Brazil. And as you can see, I am in one of my properties, okay, here in Brazil. If you watch my channel, you watch some of my videos. I have even uh, 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 I did some special videos about this my house, this my property here. And I wanted to show you guys how easy it is to acquire properties here in Brazil as a foreigner or as somebody who is not originally from Brazil compared to where I come from. I come from Ghana, okay? I come from Ghana. And it's the main reason why I want to talk to you guys today because I saw some videos circulating online about African-Americans, you know, uh, uh, finding it you know, like having troubles in Africa. And, you know, as an African, as a black brother, I like to tell you guys the truth. I know most of you guys don't like the truth because most of the time when I come on YouTube trying to discipline what am I, some of you guys think I'm a hater. But it's unfortunate that now most of you guys who were seeing me as the hater now are, Finding the, 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 the hard truth yourselves. In most of my videos, I like to talk more about how hard it is in Africa. Yes, I like to talk about this with you guys. I like to share with you guys because I know how much you guys feel about being black in in different continents not being black in africa but i know how much you guys feel about being black in the united states of america being black in europe or being black in any part of the world apart from the the, the mother continent itself which is africa okay i, I know i know about this but uh, I know how you feel about it, but as an African, I always like to come here to bring you guys the truth about Africa. For you guys to watch my channel and be able to make a, a strong decision if you really want to migrate to Africa as black diaspora, a black from the United States or black from Europe. You understand? Beleza? Fica 
vou tocar uma musiquinha e já vou voltar no palco para chamar vocês. Beleza? O que, que vai acontecer? Tira os meus Ah, mas eu queria com a Disney toda, gente. Já vai saber que vai ser impossível tirar com a Disney toda. O que, que vai fazer? Vamos tentar posicionar eles para chegar, tirar e sair. Chegou, tirou, sair. Não perde tempo. Beleza? Vamos lá. Uma salva de palmas. Most of you black Americans are blacks from different continents, okay? Yes, my voice is like this because I'm having a very strong, severe cold. Okay, don't mind my voice. I'm having a severe cold and I still wanted to do this video for you guys. And also show you guys a little bit about how we celebrate our carnival here in Brasilia. You know, for you guys who don't really know me, I'm originally from Ghana, okay? Ghana is in the west of Africa by now. I know a lot of you guys who watch my channel already know I'm from Ghana. And you know Ghana. Ghana is very popular now because of the influx of uh, black foreigners migrating to, to Ghana. And it's the main reason why I'm even doing this particular video for you guys. <laughs> I told you guys about scams, scams in West Africa specifically, because I am from West Africa, even though I have lived in many parts of Africa, I am originally from West Africa. Yes, sometimes I feel proud of it, but sometimes I feel so sad of me coming from West Africa for so many reasons, because um because of the lifestyle we have in west africa when i talk about the lifestyle i'm not talking about our culture we have a very beautiful culture in west africa okay we have nice food we have uh, 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 you know like we have beautiful beaches and stuff like that in west africa but when i when i talk about lifestyle i'm talking about our 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 uh, our individuality how do I say this? Our, our behavior, our character as, as of Africans, West Africans. That is what sometimes, you know, I, I, it's when I remember to be, to be a West African, I feel sad about. But I don't feel sad about our culture because I feel proud of it. You can see my outfit. I have a lot of them and I use them a lot because I, I feel proud of, 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 of my culture. You understand? But... The hard truth is, Africa is simply not for most of you guys from West. Most of you black people from West, Africa is not for you guys. Yes, Africa is simply not for you guys. And I'm going to tell you the reason why Africa is not for you guys. Yeah.
as brincadeiras, beleza? Ó, a família do Pedro não vem tirar foto, corre pra lá a família do Pedro e a moça que tá vestida de cupido, beleza? A moça que tá vestida de cupido, tranquilo? Vamos soltar a música aí? DJ, tá na tua mão? Você vai tocar? Ou você só vai passar o som? Ah, vai passar o som. Então vou deixar a música aqui. Nossa cintura, nossa cintura, o movimento é sexy. Nossa cintura, o movimento é sexy. O movimento é sexy. Africa. Africa is made for people who are ready to face any kind of hardship. People who are ready to, you know, like to live in any type of situation. Africa is not made for the, the, the weak. You understand? For example, in, in America or in the United States of America and Europe, you guys have food stamps, you have free hospitals, you have a lot of free stuff in Africa, we don't have that. Okay? And also, I want you to remember something. In the United States of America or in, in, in the Western world, when you have your money and you want to own a property, it's easy to do that. You just have to go through uh, the right documentation process and then you can just acquire them. But I want you guys to know that in Africa, it's not for the weak, but it's only for the strong. Because when you go to Africa and you are planning to, 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 to migrate to Africa as a Western black man or black woman, you have to be ready for this hard truth, which is what? When you get there, it's not easy to own a property, even if you have the money, because you have to be ready for people who are, who, who are, who want to, who want to squander your money, who want to scam you of your money, who want to take your money from you, who want, who, who, who only will friend you because you are, you are, you are, you are from, from a Western country. And they believe when you are from Western country, they believe you have a lot of money on you. And they don't see you as a brother or they don't see you as a sister. Because I did these kind of videos to warn you guys, but you guys refuse to simply hear or listen. You guys, you guys think the Supreme Leader, I don't want you guys to go to Africa. And you are finding it out for yourself. And most of you, especially the women I had, most of them are dying through, uh, 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 what do you call it, macumba and stuff like that. And yeah, it's real. Where we come from, where we come from, where I come from, when you are rich, people hate you. When you are doing well, people hate you. You understand? People want to be your master. 
You understand? They want to be your master. They don't want you to be their master. You understand what I'm saying? So, there is a lot of things I want to tell you guys as an African. But if you guys are ready to hear, and you want to hear more, and you want to learn more from me, then let me know at the comment section. If you let me know at the comment section, then I'll open up more to you guys. Because I try to warn you guys. I try to do what? I try to warn you you black americans black from europe i try to warn you guys i try so much but you people didn't want to listen and now you are having your fair share of experiences bad experiences and you don't have to blame anybody you have to blame yourself because the african guy who is ready to help you guys to tell you guys the truth to let you guys know how what it feels to be in africa and you guys think I was a sellout, I'm here to tell you the truth. But if you want to, if you want me to tell you more of the truth about Africa, let me know at the comment section and I'll come back because I'm, I'm not feeling so well today. I'm not feeling so well today. I just felt like I should just come and then talk to you guys a little bit and uh, yeah, open up some few things about our motherland, Africa, to you guys, because since you guys are black people like me, you look like me, I have to be real with you guys. I don't have to lie to you guys. You understand? Because white people hardly lie to each other. White people are always united when it comes to, uh, uh, you know, like, like uh, 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 the growth or well-being of each, uh, uh, each and every single one of them. They are very united. So it's the reason why I am always here on YouTube to open up to you guys who want to relocate to Africa, who look black just like me, but are not African, like by origin, <laughs> but only by descent. But anyway, it's a brother supreme leader. I don't want to talk too much. If you love my content, I just want to say a big thank you. And if you have any questions, you can leave it at the comment section because I'm not feeling well. That is why I haven't post any video lately.